barbecue on our barbecue tour. Come on in and let's see what it's all about. Come on. Head to church on Sunday, forgiveness for our sins. We'll walk back to the house. Just so I'm here with Antonio from Schmidt's Barbecue, family barbecue that is. And uh, he's been a pit master. So how long have you been a pit master? Probably oh, like eight years. Eight years? Yes. Hell oh, yeah. And uh, what is your favorite thing about being a pit master? It's everything about it. <laughs> it's right. everything like a play with the fire yeah. and the meat. So is is really blessed. Now, I love it. I love being right here by myself in the morning. <laughs> you and said uh, you were here at four o'clock this morning, right? Yes. Starting everything. So you know it's going to be great barbecue. And and so I had to ask you a question. What kind of wood do you guys use for your barbecue? The postal. Post up. Yeah. It really has a really good flavor to it. Too. Yes. We try different. Yeah. But we stick with that because it's it's give us good flavor. Right, right, right. And uh, and what's your favorite cut of meat that you like to work with or eat? Uh, right here is like all the time I'm here and we sold out very early yeah. is the pork chop. Oh, really? Pork chop. Pork chop is the bomb. <laughs> pork chop, I love pork chop myself. Yeah. So and um, and you said today you guys got Turkeys, smoked Turkey turkeys for uh, Thanksgiving. The wow. whole turkey. We're gonna cook up something about like 200 turkey this year. Wow. Yes. And it's happened pretty quick, right? Yes. Wow. That is yes. amazing. So yeah, we're blessing. So right. We and, and I have to ask you this: What kind of seasoning do you guys use for your your each cut of meat? Maybe is it all simple? Or is it a secret? Yes. No. No. It's no <laughs> secret. It's basically like everybody else, you know, salt and pepper. Right on. But of course, you have like a little twist right here, over there. We change so much at the beginning, so the boss, you know, like take it off a little bit this, <laughs> put a little bit more there. Right. So it's all the time. That's the beauty for the barbecue. Yeah. It's always have some place to improve it. Right. And it's, it's, well, you know, your, your quality of barbecue, and this is the cool thing about going on a barbecue tour. Yeah. And it's my first one, but since I've, we've done this, the quality of just the love and craft that you guys put into your barbecue has been amazing. It's, yeah. it's yeah, I, I refer to almost like country music. Mm -hmm. Right, and I, as a country artist, we take time and we we spend time on our music, we yes. craft it, we, we have love into it. So when people hear it, it's it's almost the same thing as eating barbecue. Exactly. As soon as they taste it, it's like, this is great. Yes. So, and and being a pit master, I respect all you guys a whole, a hundred percent. So I have to ask this: if there is anybody that wants to be a pit master, what do you have any advice for them? I think so, like, the only like advice is you need to love, you know, what you do. It's the right. same thing like you say. Right. So you love what you do. Exactly. And I love what I do. I think so these are reflected in, in the quality of the meat. Exactly. So it's why here is like, so. uh, of course we need to be humble, sure. but it's like every day you just don't know how many people come and say like, hey, this is the best barbecue I eat in my life. Right. So this is right. like, it's so much great for that, you know yeah. what I mean? Come and shake a hand. And, right. Because right here, it's like, it really is no competition. It's like barbecue is a family. Exactly. You know what I mean? So Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It really brings a lot of people together. Exactly. And enjoying just the love and craft exactly. of, the, of the barbecue. It's yeah. like, same thing with country music. Everybody comes to just hear great country music. Everybody comes to you guys to eat great barbecue. Exactly. It all up just for you BK Texas was good. Off to Lockhart. <laughs>